Good morning, everybody, on this fine and cool morning in Johannesburg. Uh, Monday the 8th of, what are we? March. Oh, there you have it. Uh, 2021. With regards to the class action suit, um, I've been doing uh, some background consultations and so on and so forth. And effectively, going forward, um, we were able to reduce the original amount from uh, each person or each applicant from three and a half thousand rand to a thousand rand. Um, so, guys, I'm doing everything on my side to try and make this as affordable and as easy as possible. Um, and uh, the objectives of the class action suit are to bring around significant legal changes within the context of family law specifically related to uh, contact care, guardianship, and maintenance around your child. So one of the things that we will be applying for is the removal of Section 192021, where there is openly hostile gender bias towards fathers, okay? And that needs to be removed out of law and changed to the biological parents, irrespective of whether they are male or female, have automatic rights of contact care, guardianship and maintenance of their children. And that no parent, not, not, no one parent, along with his or her lawyer, in the absence of violence, abuse or neglect, can unilaterally decide the fate of the child's relationship with the other parent. Where quantifiable, measurable, defined, provable in a court of law, violence, abuse or neglect can be proven along with forensic and psychological as well as police investigation and any other means necessary to prove that one or both of the parents are negligent or violent or abusive, uh, then that, that must be presented in court and that the based on the evidence the judge or the magistrate will restrict diminish or completely remove the right of contact and care from one or both of the parents the other thing that we are looking to change is that lawyers and advocates uh, cannot unilaterally act as um, or impersonate because that is effectively what they have been doing um, uh, impersonating magistrates and judges. So removing the ability of a lawyer or an advocate to unilaterally decide in the absence of violence, abuse or neglect uh, the, 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 the rights of the one parent over the other. The other thing is, is that we want uh, the uh, de facto standard of 50-50 contact care, guardianship and maintenance as the de facto standard for the right of the child to continue its uninterrupted relationship uh, with, with both of its biological parents. The other part of the class action suit is that we want to uh, make sure that um, the best interest of the child pertaining specifically to uh, family law around contact care, guardianship and maintenance is that the child must automatically have daily physical, emotional, psychological, um, social, um, contact care, guardianship and maintenance with and by both biological parents at all time. And any parent or parents uh, or um, any other entity, whether it be a lawyer or a psychologist that attempts in part or in whole to deny the child its inherent right that they must be automatically charged with uh, child abuse and imprisoned accordingly and with a professional involved must automatically be removed from his or her particular profession and not allowed to practice their particular profession again. So once again, guys, we've managed, I've been racking my brains. How do we do this? How do we handle this? How do we get it right? So I've come up with another plan. Um, so the original amount was um, uh, three and a half thousand rand. It's been reduced to a thousand rand. 
uh, we would need uh, three equal payments uh, as an absolute minimum, alternatively one lump sum. The quicker we can do this, the quicker we can stop the nonsense. Here is an opportunity. So please get hold of us for our banking details so that we can take this forward and we can start the class action suit against the state. It's up to you. It's in your hands. So please get hold of me. Uh, alternatively, email info at f4j.co.za. And if you have any input into the case, then please get hold of me.